Well, good morning. It's a beautiful day out there. So right now we're just cooking up some breakfast. We're gonna get a coffee on the go and uh, we're cooking up some sausages. Let me have a look. So we chewed up a lot of that wood last night. There's probably enough wood to fill the stove again so so that's the first thing first we're gonna have a little bit of breakfast a coffee then we're gonna load up the sled and we're going for wood and we're gonna hammer down on that because that's priority I don't know if we're gonna get out fishing today but we'll see I'd like to get over there and check some areas out see how that goes but first and foremost we need some food to Fire up the engine. 16 degrees. So it's pretty good. Last night I didn't, I let the fire go cold maybe uh, once and it got pretty darn cold in here. So I filled up the stove probably, it was two o'clock and I kept checking every time I'd get up, I'd check for the Northern lights. And so I got up at two, I loaded up the stove. Didn't really need much, but I opened up the draft so it would stay warmer because I, I had shut the draft down and I got up again at four o'clock and the northern lights were going like crazy. I got a little bit on a time lapse but it, I'm not sure how well it turned out so hopefully again tonight we'll see it and I'll be a little bit more prepared. It's pretty tired last night so okay well once we have some breakfast some coffee we'll see you over getting some more wood. Hopefully we can find a couple of nice big trees and we're ready to go. Now you can see what that box was for. Sophie's in there ready to go. Windshield's on and we're headed over there. <sighs> okay, well, I found a big tree. It's completely dead. Actually, I found two. There's one here, but there's a big one back there. <sighs> you know, it's not gonna be easy, but that tree's worth it because it's big. There's probably uh, a day and a half's burning in that. So that's definitely worth the effort. Like I said last night, there's nobody here. It's, it's us, me and you. So play it safe, take our time and get this done right. Anyway, let's go see what we can do here. Let's go see what we can do. Ooh. Hopefully, I can fall it this way. Save me a lot of walking. That tree could be dead. All the bark's coming off too. That's a big one. Okay, so this one's dead, but we're going after the big one first. Okay, whoo, not too bad. Okay, well this is good burning. It's worth the effort. From what I can tell, it's probably the biggest tree I'm gonna get around here. Anyway, no complaints, we're getting wood. Another beauty. Slowly but surely. And it doesn't take long to kill a day, getting wood, all the other stuff. What time is it? it uh, it's already 11 o'clock. Oh, it can't be. It's gotta be, it's gotta be 12 o'clock. My watch must be wrong. Huh, I gotta check that. <clears throat> Okay, well, I'm gonna keep hauling this out. No point in boring you guys. Whew. Okay, well, we got a good little stash here. I don't think it's quite enough yet, but Sophie's in there. What we're gonna do, we're gonna cut this up, take a few loads over and uh, see how, see how much it is. Oh, 
Okay, well, that's only one load. It's not a lot of wood. We need, I think I need at least two of those. So I thought I had more when it was all laying out here in the big clumps. So we're definitely coming back for another load. I don't want Okay, great news. Just over from where we fell that last tree, I dumped it off, I came back, and I found seven good-sized trees, very similar to this one. These are great burners. It's about the biggest I can see around here. And there's uh, seven of them in there dead, and I just took two. So there's lots of wood, and I got a trail in there now. With this and what I have there, we're good to go for at least today and tomorrow. And uh, another one of the things you've got to keep in mind, even though it's cold out here, we're, I'm sweating, and you got to stay hydrated because stuff like that will take you down. You don't realize it, but your body needs water. Cheers. Oh. Okay. I had Sophie with me. Her paws were getting cold. She was kind of, she went to go have a pee and she was walking funny. So I'm like, ah. So I disconnected, I drove her back. I came back and I cut this. So now I'm gonna cut this up, load it up, and we're gonna go get warmed up and have a hot, probably a hot chocolate. That's what I'm really looking forward to. So enough talking, let's get to it. Okay, well this is awesome. I think it's a little dirty, that screen. Anyway, look at the wood pile. We got quite a bit now. Pretty happy about that. That's definitely today, tonight, tomorrow, tomorrow night, maybe. We'll see. Okay, well, we're a little more organized and I'm pretty darn happy about it. So, there you have it. Okay, well, it's breakfast time. We're having some bagels with jam and sausages. Morning. Let's see if this thing will start. Oh. Oh. Beauty. Come on, baby. Oh. One, two. Oh. Oh. Whew. You know it's cold when. Come on. This thing just fires up in one pull, usually half a pull. It's cold. around minus 29 still. Should start warming up pretty quick with the uh, sun out though. I'm gonna head out in a few minutes. And uh, get the augers and stuff. I'm gonna go check out some ice spots. See what we can find for fish. 
Well, we had visitors last night. Not sure if you can see that. That's one big wolf. Look at the size of that. And you can see, I followed his tracks up to about the shovel. He just noticed them. Taking Sophie out for a little walk before I go. But uh, I thought I heard something last night. <clears throat> I heard an owl last night and uh, I was wondering what he was going on about and then I thought I heard something else. But uh, anyway, interesting, they're that close. Let's get going. Okay, I don't know about you, but that was painstaking. Holy Moses. Whew. It's a lot of work. And I didn't even do any of it. This stupid thing did. Okay, huh. We're 28 feet here. That's not so bad. Well, let's get a line in the water and see what happens here. Somebody will skidoo over there. Looks like he might be going ice fishing. He's a nice spot. Not too much going on. Man. Whew. There was a snowmobiler with a toboggan and a couple of kids that went by. And uh, they went down that trail. I think, uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to give this about another 10-15 minutes. And then we'll go back. We'll go get Sophie. We'll get geared up. We'll throw the gear in. And then we'll head down that way. Check things out. Going a little... Uh, Exploring expedition. What do you think? I think it's a great idea. It's something that everybody told me too. I'm a little bit late. It's uh, it's about ten o'clock. They said usually the bites on on these lakes either very early in the morning or around. They seem to hit around four o'clock. So what I'm thinking. We'll give this a little bit more time. Oh, man. And then uh, we go for a little uh, cruise and explore down that trail and off to the other lakes and see if... I'm really cu curious to see how many people are ice fishing on these other lakes. So, anyway, I think it'll be fun. Jump on the sled. It looks to be about uh, five or six kilometers from here. If I haven't already showed you in the drone footage, I back to camp, warm up, and uh, pack up, and we're going to take a cruise. The nice thing is, I know somebody's in there. If something were ever to happen, he's probably going to come back out. So, if we're on the trail or something breaks down, not that I'm anticipating that, but it's always nice to know that there's somebody around. He went down there with a few kids, so I'm sure if something were to happen, he could help me out. Not that I think something's gonna happen, but it's always nice to have a little bit of backup. A little bit of peace of mind, actually, because we're gonna take Sophie with us. And I put a tip up in, and uh, we'll check on that in a little bit. All right, let's go get warmed up.
let's go get some fuel in this and uh, we'll go for a drive see what uh, the Northwest Territories has to offer Okay, well, we're a long way from anywheres. Long way. And I went to come up here and see what the view was like. And I didn't, I, th I just thought it was land, but man, it's a monster drift of snow. So we're buried pretty good. So a couple of options, roll it or dig it out. So what are we gonna do? Now, get rid of the sled. I have to get a little weight out of there. Okay. Oh, let's see what happens. Now, we'll tip it back. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's start making our way back. Uh, we're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get off this lake, go through that trail, and then, yeah, we're gonna go off this lake, through the trail, onto another lake, and then cut through an, off onto another lake, and then we're gonna stop there and have a coffee. Yeah, okay. Okay, well, we're about to find out if my idea is going to work. This is what I did. Use pericord, wrapped it around here, down there, down there. Okay, well, we made it back, and it worked out pretty darn good. So we have another tree here. like that okay well we're gonna unpack it warmed up and then we're gonna go check our uh, fishing rod see if we've got this great big monster trout on there <laughs> somehow I doubt it but you never know the um fishing line nothing on it I pulled it up and we just finished dinner I had pork chops again I had bought a big pack family pack for the trip so they're done kind of kind of glad they're done because I now don't want to see a pork chop for a while anyway Sophie's ready for bed and uh yeah we're just gonna keep an eye out and see if there's any more northern lights tonight see if we can get some more video of that 
And other than that, I'm not going to bore you. So we'll just see you first thing in the morning. I'm pretty tired. We're going to crash pretty early here. So, and I did set up the, um, the camera out there just in case those wolves come in again tonight. Be nice to get a shot of those guys. Um, be interesting to see if they come in. Don't know. Anyway, have a good night and we'll see you first thing in the morning.